hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys what i've purchased over the summer for my first apartment i'm going to be showing you guys stuff from ikea marshall's and bed bath and beyond today but before we get started i wanted to show you guys my coffee i filmed a little thing of how i made it i'll show you guys it's a double shot of espresso order from duncan with a protein shake over it it's so good it's really filling and it's also very healthy for you so you guys should definitely check that out all right so first i'm going to start with ikea if you guys have never been to ikea you should totally go it's super like big and there's so many room ideas and it's just a really cool place to walk through i'm going to insert some clips here so i went to ikea with my mom this past weekend shout out to my mom and i picked up a lot of things so we will start with that first so first in this big huge bag i got two of these pillows these are pillows to go on my bed, like the decorative ones. That's what they're called. And these are gonna be on my bed, not the ones that I like sleep on, but the decorative ones that I'll put my bedding on once I get my bedding. Then I got this bath rug for my bathroom, obviously. I already have one that's gray, um, but the bathroom is tile, so I wanted to have something like underneath the sink um, just to like catch water and it, it to be more comfortable Next I got two of these pillows These are 20 by 20. These are decorative pillows to go on my couch and then um, so I got two of those and Two pillow covers for them They are this label And I got two of those I also got one of these, I think it's called like a frother, but it's from Ikea, it was only a couple bucks. Um, I know a couple people that have these and I'm obsessed and I've wanted one for a long time. I didn't know where to find one and then there was randomly one at Ikea, so here we go. I also got this pack of four washcloths. Um, these ones are like really like thin, kind of crappy ones. I'm gonna use these ones um, after work to shower obviously um just so the nice ones that i have i'm not washing those constantly because i want to use these ones separately from when i get home from work and i can just throw them in with my scrubs or whatever and wash those i also got this laundry bag for my scrubs so that whenever i get off of work i can undress put them in here and bring them straight to the laundry machine so i'm not getting any germs on my furniture or um, in my car, I don't know when I'll end up changing, but I got this to help me with that. And lastly, kind of nursing related, is this laundry bag. This one has a mesh top on it, so I can put my shoes in it. I'm gonna keep my shoes in the car, again, so I don't spread germs all over my apartment. This is a sheet set for my couch. So this has, um, a fitted sheet, a sheet, and two pillow shams. So the couch that I got, I will talk about that in a minute, um, has like a pull out couch like feature kind of thing. So I got this bedding so that if someone sleeps over, they can put like sheets down and stuff on the couch. And then lastly in this bag is this. I don't really know how to describe it because I'm not gonna put it together right now, but it's like a, it's an over the cabinet little thing. So I'm either gonna put like trash in here or um, like recyclables or cleaning supplies, something in the kitchen. So it'll be like inside the cabinet kind of hidden. But I thought this was cool and it was a couple bucks so I picked that up. All right, so my second bag from Ikea. I have this pillow. This will be the one that I sleep on. This is the name of it. It's supposed to be for back and side sleepers. Um, and it's like really squishy and like memory foam-ish. I really like that. The only other thing is this little welcome mat. So obviously I'll put this outside so when people walk in, they can wipe their feet off before they get inside. And 
Then the last things that I got from Ikea were a couple pieces of furniture. I will insert um, pictures like from the website of them because I'm not going to go get them right now. But I got the super awesome couch that I was talking about. It's like an L shape and then it pulls out to a pull out couch. Um, literally everyone was looking at that in Ikea so it must be a popular couch. Um, I also got a coffee table to go by the couch. I got two side tables, one for the living room, one for my bedroom, and I think that's everything furniture-wise. If I forgot anything, I will enter it in now. Next, I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and I picked up a couple things there. So first, I just got another pillow. This one is extra firm. I like a lot of support. Like I literally sleep on like three pillows when I'm sleeping. So I got a really nice um, one. And also their bedding was on sale, like all bedding items. I think that was like 50% off or something. I'm not sure of the exact price. Um, I also got a mattress pad, a generic one, just to protect my mattress, obviously. And then I got a couple more things. Um, this is for the kitchen. For, to hang like my kitchen towel um, so that it's not just like laying on the counter and it can dry. I also got just a paper towel holder. Obviously you know what that is for. Um, I got a new loofah because I needed one. Oh, I got this. Very excited about this, an oil and vinegar bottle. Um, my mom also got one just for our house and I've been using it to cook this week and I don't know why. I'm so obsessed with this. It makes it so much easier to pour olive oil out. So I'm very excited about that. And then lastly in this bag is, it kind of came apart, but this is a thing that goes like behind your kitchen sink. So this will hold a sponge and then this has just soap in it. And it's cool because it, like the spout is right here. So you can hold your sponge here and press the soap down like that. I don't know, I thought it was really cool. It was like five bucks, so I picked that up. And that is everything from Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, so lastly, I went to Marshall's and I picked up a couple things there, um, mainly for kind of the kitchen area. So first I got this set of silverware. Obviously I need silverware for myself and other people to eat. Um, this one was nice, this one was $10 um, and it comes with a bunch of pieces. Kitchen towels, there's a set of four. These were $7.99 and they're just like really big, nice gray towels for the kitchen, which I'm excited about. I also got a shower liner. This was $5. Um, I already have a shower curtain. I'm just gonna use the one that I used in my previous apartment. Um, so I just needed a liner for underneath that. I also got a set of shower curtain holders or rings, whatever they're called to match that. These kind of fell apart, but I got a set of four coasters. They're nice wood ones and they have this on the back so they won't like um, scratch my stuff. But these are really nice because you know, people come over and they put their drinks down and then they get water rings on your wood and it makes you mad. So how to get those. Next, I got this for the kitchen. It's a little like mason jar soap pump. Um, just for hand stuff next to the kitchen sink. And then I also got this candle. This is white sage and cilantro, which sounds really weird. It doesn't smell like, it doesn't smell like um, cilantro, if that makes sense, even though it's called that. It's like a really nice crisp scent. It would smell so good. And either the bedroom or the living room, it's just like very fresh. Okay, so last bag from Marshall's. Um, like I said, this is a bunch of kitchen stuff. This is super exciting. This is called an avocado pod. So it helps keep your avocado fresh. I don't know if you can really see it in the pictures, but it helps keep your avocado fresh. And then if you make guac, you can turn it like that and it'll hold your guac. So I just thought that was super cute. And it's like green and it looks like an avocado. I just thought it was cute. So I got that. Um, this is a tub shroom just to collect hair and my shower kind of gross, but that way I don't have to ask someone to unclog my shower if I accidentally put hair down there. Uh, a whisk, obviously self-explanatory. This is a over the door hook. I'll probably put this in the bathroom um, so it can hold multiple towels. So there's two hooks on the bottom here and two hooks on the top. And then, 
I got some chip clips. These ones are also magnetic if I wanted to hang something off my refrigerator just for snacks to keep them fresh in my pantry. This is a pot like organizer holder. So this will be useful in my cabinets to either store my pots this way or that way just to save some space and so they're not all falling on top of each other when I'm getting them out. I also got a spice rack for the same reason, just so I can display them nicely and be able to see um, what spices I wanna grab from my cabinet. And then lastly, I got a silverware tray. So obviously I can divide my silverware up in my drawer and they're not just like thrown in there. So that is everything that I got. Um, like I said, this is my first apartment. I lived in an apartment on campus in college, um, but I would still kind of consider that a dorm. So this is the first time I'm moving out and moving out on my own. So I'm really excited and I'm really nervous. Um, but it was really fun to go shopping for all these things. And if you guys go shopping, if you need to go shopping for college or your apartment, highly, highly recommend the couch that I got. I'll make sure to link that down below. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also comment down below if you guys would like to see another video like this or what you would like to see next. I am going to go ahead and link most of the big stuff, mostly the stuff from Ikea. Um, down below in the links but if you guys want links to anything else that I mentioned in this video I will try my hardest to get that so please comment down below and I will try and get that link for you hi guys so the my camera cut off at the last part but I just want to say that I hope you guys are having a great day I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time in the next video bye guys